when you are bipolar and living in Haiti, it's like living in hell. People in Haiti doesn't understand mental illness. You either crazy or you're not crazy. So if you are bipolar and then you know something is wrong with you, you don't talk about it. Because first of all, people might make fun of you and say, oh, she's crazy, don't listen to her. Seriously? People who doesn't understand what bipolar feels like annoys me. Sometimes they kind of say, snap out of it. Trust me, if I could snap out of it, I will totally snap out of it. Not everything about being bipolar is negative. Uh, in my case, I also draw and paint. I she, My dad didn't teach me. I just pick it up naturally. And then music makes sense to me. And some people say it's because I'm bipolar that those things make sense to me. Not everybody gets it. Oh, I love writing. I love creative things. So I guess I have bipolar to think for that. And also, there is another weird part about people that are bipolar. Uh, sometimes, which is uh, the mania. We would, well, in my case, sometimes I would decide not to take my medication because uh, I felt like being manic is rough, being depressed after that. It's a very, very, very vicious cycle. You would decide, oh my gosh, my life is too normal. I am going not, I will not take my medication for a week or a month until I am uh, manic. Because when you're manic, you are super happy. You talk a lot. And then sometimes I talk and talk and talk and I feel like uh, everything I say is cold in my brain again. And it's like very euphoric. Then after that, if that lasts one day, two days, three days, I crash. To me, it's rough crashing to get that elation, that euphoria that you feel when you're manic. So I have to learn that I need to take care of myself. When you have a family, when you have children, these things changes you. Uh, you take care of yourselves because they depend on you. They don't have anybody else that can cook their dinner or clean their beds, make the room, help them with their homeworks. They need you. So when you are, when you have a family, you cannot be uh, selfish anymore. But when you are like young and not married. And you don't have any responsibility you tend to do this kind of things so um, these are all the things that come with depression uh, with um, bipolar then uh, there's the depression side of it it's weird sometimes it's you feel like you need to feel weird yes you need to feel. So if you're normal, everything is okay. Okay is not enough. You need to feel when you are um, when you are bipolar. Feeling is essential to you. So you would decide, okay, I'm not gonna take my medication. So I feel, and then you become very depressed. You think about driving your car in a hole or driving in the highway and close your eyes. Crazy, yes. Logical, no. Do do alcohols. If you uh, drink alcohol, does it help when you are uh, depressed or uh, when you are bipolar? Yes, it does work, but it works for a very short time. And when you crash, it takes longer for you to get back on your feet. Drugs, drugs, they do not work whatsoever. So. Um, I am not talking about medication. So some people, I have a friend of mine who says when she's depressed, she smokes pot and that helps her. But um, that leave her with very, very, her hair feel empty for way too long and she cannot function. And another thing with people that are bipolar, we are terrible at following directions. And then that means if we are working for in the corporate world and then the worst profession is being um, a nurse. We have tendency of forgetting things. 
and this is one of the reason I didn't go to medical school because when you are responsible for other people's life you cannot afford to make mistakes and then I am terrible at taking uh, criticisms also because uh, when you are bipolar you are a little bit of narcissistic also you think you are better than everybody else when you are in a manic state and then you cannot tell me Oh, if I were you, I would not do this. The, who he, who is she to tell me not to do that? I know. I, I am the expert in whatever. No, you're not. But when you are manic, you was, you have self confidence. You can conquer the world, and nothing can happen to you. So um, it can be pretty funny when you're talking to people and this is gosh this girl can talk but that's what happened it's a weird weird thing uh, bipolar sometimes I wonder what is the purpose of someone being bipolar why do you have to be bipolar uh, to me I know it's genetic but to people I it could be environmental but I truly don't know but uh, what I'm doing right now, uh, I am trying to take care of myself and make videos. Maybe people would say, well, it's not just me. Gosh, there are other people like me. And there is hope. Uh, we just have to be aware of whatever state you're in and deal with it accordingly and appropriately.